It bubbled up from a bunch of bands yeah, that didn't have a place to play and found a place to play. <laughs> Who played? That's the Wayne Band. 1588 Madison Avenue. We want to try to introduce Memphis and the world to the new music that was going across everywhere but here it seemed like. So much good music that's been just, it's like it doesn't exist in Memphis. It was a calling for me. I, I felt like that I had to change music. I'm standing with Mark Kaleher, who is the doorman tonight. You're the doorman most nights, aren't you? Why do you come to Antenna? Ladies and gentlemen, the most hated man in Memphis. I hate him, and I'm sure you'll hate him too. The Modifier. If anyone is familiar with the club, it is a place where you can listen to new, adverse type music, and you might even want to dance a little bit. Barky Dog, put your hands together. The Antenna Club especially was one of the places that basically kept us fed back in the early 80s. Well, they thought that the Antenna Club was evil. It looked scary, which was cool. We would be playing a Coliseum somewhere, but we knew Saturday night we are playing the Antenna. And we knew we better have our shit together. You know, there was no fooling these people. At the Antenna Club, you realize that the bands in the audience are, are actually the same people. The Antenna was a location where all these groups came together. It allowed you to come and bring anything to the table that you wanted to bring. And if it was bullshit, people would let you know it's bullshit. Thanks for calling the Antenna Club. We're located at 1588 Madison tonight. We got a Killian's Red beer bust and baby self-hate. Why do you come to Antenna to dance? We always felt like we needed to stay in Memphis. And if we couldn't make it in Memphis, then we didn't want to make it anywhere else. Let's make some music that changes the world because it's complicated and funky and whatever. It's like, no, nah, let's make some noise. Here we go. Hit it, guys. The Oblivions. We would watch the calendar because there was so much shit happening. And it was happening really fast. In the day before the internet allowed you to kind of vicariously figure out who the bands were in all the cities. You really had to go to the actual source. And in Memphis, that meant uh, the antenna.